In this video, we're going to find the derivative of an exponential function with base e. It says, find k prime of x if k of x is equal to 2 over x to the fifth times e to the 4x to the fourth plus 4x cubed. You can see we have a product rule here. So I'm going to start, and actually before I do the product rule, I'm going to write this as 2x to the, to the negative 5. So we're going to say k of x is actually equal to 2x to the negative 5 e to the 4x to the 4th plus 4x cubed. Makes it easier to, to do this product rule. So we have a multiplication here. And we will have u is equal to 2x to the negative fifth. u prime is equal to negative 10 x to the negative sixth. So we bring the negative 5 to the front, that's negative 10. Subtract 1, that's negative 6. v is equal to e to the 4x to the fourth plus 4x cubed. And v prime then would be equal to, when I take the derivative of this, remember that the derivative of e to the x is itself but I have a chain rule here, so I'm going to have e to the x, or not e to the x, e to the 4x to the 4th plus 4x cubed. And I'm going to multiply that times the derivative of the inside, which would be 4x to the 4th plus 4x cubed. So I end up with e to the 4x to the 4th plus 4x cubed. And I'm going to be multiplying that then times derivative of this would be 16x cubed plus 12x squared. So I would end up with 16x cubed plus 12x squared e to the 4x to the 4th plus 4x cubed. So if I go ahead and... Now use the product rule, so I would say negative 10. I'm going to write that as over x to the fifth, x to the sixth, times e to the 4x to the fourth plus 4x cubed. And then I'm going to have plus 2 over x to the fifth times. I'll have it being multiplied times this piece here, which would be 16x cubed plus 12x squared e to the 4x to the 4th plus 4x cubed. So then I can, looks to me like I can multiply this through this piece here. And if I did that, I would end up with a negative... 10 over x to the 6th, e to the 4x to the 4th, plus 4x cubed. Distribute that through each piece, and I would end up with 32, so I'm going to say plus 32, over x to the 5th would be on the bottom, x cubed is on top, so that leaves x squared on the bottom. And then plus 12 times 2 would be 24. And then x squared on top, x to the fifth on the bottom, that's x cubed on the bottom. e to the 4x to the fourth plus 4x cubed. And that would be the derivative.